What's up? My name is Jacob, and this is Cyborg Reacts. Um, today, we're going to be reacting to Joe Rogan and Eddie Bravo arguing over whether or not nuclear bombs are real. And I am going to use logic to explain why this argument is stupid and why it is stupid to argue that nuclear bombs aren't real. Um, if you're new here, uh, hit the subscribe button. If you like the video, hit like. If you don't like the video, you can dislike it if you want to, but I would really appreciate it if you comment down below and say, this is what you can do better. Um, but I'm not going to hold you any longer, and we're going to go ahead and get into the video, and I appreciate you watching. Look at How do you know that smack was real? The conspiracy to keep this quiet, the fact that the government's nuclear tests most likely killed John Wayne and a shitload of actors from fucking cancer in the desert. They were dropping bombs not knowing what the fuck they were doing. And there's plenty of evidence that they didn't know what the fuck they were doing. Yeah. If you watch the videos of old nuclear test site with soldiers running towards the blast, yeah, have I've you seen, seen those? those? Yeah, I've seen they're those. They're fucking insane. You think it, looks like, it looks like, I don't know, it just like all that old footage looks like it doesn't <laughs> look authentic. It looks, okay. it looks like they faked on it. Look, I, I don't know Mr. Bravo. I don't, I don't know Eddie Bravo at all. But we about to go down a rabbit hole real quick because... You cannot have a conversation, intelligent conversation, or a conversation at all with somebody that doesn't believe anything's real, right? Somebody thinks that just because the government came out and said whoop-de-whoop, -whoop, that means that it's not real at all, and they don't trust anything that anybody says about anything. They don't trust media. They don't trust anything. If they don't believe in anything, you can't hold a conversation with them about anything that is, like, remotely scholarly. You can only have totally casual conversations about whether or not it's raining outside. Not about the weather, because they're not going to believe it's going to snow in three days because it's not real. About the rain. And then they're going to try to argue that... How do we know that rain's real? Like, how do we know they don't just take water bottles up and, and, and giant helicopters and just sprinkle it over you? Shit. What about... But I don't know. I'm I can't a, remember the last time I saw one. I'm what a do you, retard. Do you think retarded. nuclear yeah, bombs are I'm, fake? Is that what you're saying to me? I, you know, there's a conspiracy oh. theory that, that, uh, um, <laughs> you're the O, they already know it's so they're like, exist. here we go, bro. That, uh, they never actually figured it out, but they realized that the, the threat of nuclear bombs is good enough. It's, but Eddie, you can see the bombs. The atom bombs? But how do you know by them seeing up. them that they're Did real? Did you ever see the one where they dropped the bomb? <laughs> like, do you hear that? How do you know by seeing it that it's real? How do you know that your eyeballs aren't lying to you? Like, what are you talking the about? In the ocean. And they didn't know <laughs> how much of a blast it would create. But what, I'm, so saying, but what I'm saying is, they didn't have all the I'm saying, ability to fake this no, when but, they did but, it. But all I'm saying is, how do you know it wasn't just a regular powerful bomb? Like how? Well, I'm telling you, Mr. Bravo, right? If you're watching this, right? Anybody that knows Mr. Bravo, I need you to reach out to him. Tell him to get on a plane. To Japan, right? Go talk to an old Japanese man. <laughs> Go talk to him. And ask him if the nuclear bombs were real. Go ask. I promise you they'll be like, yes, I saw it with my own eyes. And they'll be like, how do I know that you're real? <laughs> how do you know? How do you know by it's watching a, a bomb, bomb go okay, off? But how do you know it. it's nuclear if you Pull watch up the, bomb? the nuclear test? I don't know, I don't know what a nuclear bomb looks like we when have, it blows up. I, I don't really know what his question is either. Like, are you asking like what nuclear bomb means like what is a nuclear bomb is that your question or is your question how do i know that the bomb is a nuclear bomb i don't know it's nuclear Compared to a regular bomb. i don't know how eddie, would you listen know the to difference? him i'm eddie, not a bomb eddie, expert eddie, eddie, i don't know eddie, eddie listen have, to him we have things that can he test. thinks he's really got a point too he thinks he's like on to something because I know people, you can do tests I don't know. you can do tests with those instruments but i've never done those but tests you can you? you can't i, have I don't know can. So can you i don't know eddie you can though this is not something that you're studied in I'm saying I don't right? know. I know, but I'm, I'm saying not, I don't know. But I'm, I'm saying telling I don't, you, you can. How can people look at a bomb? You're saying someone <laughs> else figured it out. How can you look at a bomb and I think tell, you're thinking? All right, hold up. I got you. I got you. Just one second. I got you. Sorry, my phone's on. Hey, how do you know that a nuclear bomb is real? October 3rd, 2019. MIT scientists invent way to verify if nuclear weapon is real or fake. How long did that take me? Like 35 seconds? 
thinking was, about shit the wrong way. Was, I really do. No, I'm just saying, if there was a videos of just saying, bombs what are you up, saying? would you be able to pick out the nuclear bombs? Eddie, they make these giant mushroom clouds. They're very unusual. It's All not I'm like a regular bomb. I'm not saying... That, Pull that video I'm just up saying, of the bomb I, in the ocean. How can anybody tell, like a regular Before person, you how could you tell? Before you ask that question, I think you should probably okay. talk to a nuclear physicist. And I'm study, just asking questions. Question I don't know. It, but to question... If you are asking a question without looking for an answer, you're just a dick. You're just a dick. Question it like it's not real is ridiculous. They killed how many fucking people in Nagasaki and Hiroshima? Hiroshima. How do you know Tons what kind of bomb that was? Watch this. Watch how this. do you know what kind of Watch bomb that was? Look at this. Because they still have issues with radiation to this day. To this day in know, Japan, you know they're having that issues with radiation. That is the to this day, amount of power you could ever imagine. I could never imagine something that can blow the ocean the a dynamite. mile into the sky. Okay. And that's just one video of it. There's another one of those videos where they do it from a distance. Where you Look at the water, where it's falling from. I that's get crazy. that. See if you can but find do one. Do you understand? It could be a nuclear bomb. I'm saying, all I'm but saying is, guess? how can what are you, you saying? know for sure? Look at that. How can you Dude, know for sure? how many whales? Eight. I'm telling you, you just cannot have a conversation with a dude like that, right? If you have a friend like that, anytime he talks, just smack him, right? Anytime you're trying to have a conversation and he starts doing that shit, just smack him. Just, oh, every, I'm telling you, everyone. it's the only way to get rid of it because he's just trying to cause chaos. Just, just how do you know that smack was real? You know what I'm saying? Just smack him as hard as you can. Like, how do you know that was real stupid? Look at that. Yeah, I don't know if, what kind of bomb that is. That's what they should have done. They should just smack him. I think that's that he does like jujitsu though, so maybe it's not a good idea to smack Eddie Bravo. Know, but why question? conventional bombs? It's well, what, what difference does it make? Because Eddie's Eddie's saying the know. reason why they threaten nuclear bombs to keep everyone kind of chill, but we might not have the. So if the reason that you say that there's nuclear bombs is to keep people chill, but you have this other bomb right that can blow up the ocean a mile high and literally can level an entire city with one drop, right? Why would you just not tell them that you have this real thing? Why would you say, I have this make-believe weapon? Why would you not just be like, look, I did that with this. I'll do it to you, too. I, I, there just, there's no logical, like, processing present in that. Like, there's no logic at all. They, they've got the you power don't... to do that, dude. That would wipe out a fucking city. But maybe you, you could do that, that with, with, with just regular conventional bombs. Maybe you just, maybe that's like okay. 10. Okay. You know, what just... I'm saying is, I don't know. Right. Well, you should find out. I don't know. By... Okay. This is this is a nuclear bomb. Okay. I mean, the scientists all agree there's no conspiracy. The conspiracy okay. is amongst idiots. Okay. These people that are talking about it online, they literally have no idea what they're talking about, and they're spreading. I, this I, that's nonsense. what I'm saying. I don't know. I, I understand. understand. I don't. And see, that's the real issue, and I think that that's what Mr. Rogan is kind of upset about. Mr. Rogan, I think that's what Joe's kind of mad about is that this Eddie gentleman comes on his platform, right, and he's just spreading misinformation. You're just creating nonsensical chaos. You're just going on the internet, and since you can do it, you're just saying everything's fake, right? You should just lay off the psychedelic drugs. Chill out and just, like, read a book. Because not everything is fake, no. I mean, if you want to really question it, then, like, how do you know that you're not just a brain in a vat, right? And that's just all fake. Because we all share the experience together, right? So you start from there, and that's what real is. Real is what you can see and touch and hear and smell and taste and, like, if somebody heard it and saw it and smelt it, it really happened, bro. There's real first, like, first-person accounts of something occurring. It's real. And if you are trying to question whether or not something is real, that is legitimately totally real, this isn't something that's theoretical. It's something that has literally historically occurred. If you're trying to question that. You're just an ass. Trying to confuse people and cause chaos. Oh, no. I understand you don't know, but don't even bother questioning. It's a waste of time. It's a, it's a, you're going down a rabbit hole for no Using reason. my platform to ruin people's how day. Do you know? How do you know? How do you know? How, I don't how, need to you, know. What do you, you care about me wasting my time? Going well, I, it's like a kid, you know, it's like a, like a five-year-old. You know, and you're like, um, don't do that. And he's like, why? And then you tell him why. And he's like, well, why? why can't I do that? And he, you tell him why. And then he's like, why? And then you tell him why. And he's like, why? And then no matter what you say, he's just going to say why because he's just trying to get on your nerves. I could, I could waste my time on whatever. Why are you, you so concerned? To? Why are you so concerned about me wasting my because time? Because you waste our time too. Right. It's we an start interesting talking conversation. About whether or not nuclear we don't bombs have to talk about this. Answers, though, we don't, so don't have to talk about this. Why don't you want to find the answer to it? Why do you just want to question it? You could look up the I answer. Would have, you I could would, go study You could it. look up. Yeah, you could look up anything. It's not going to look up. I'm, if you literally want to know the answer to this particular question. You could look it up. Not, on no, 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 I'm not. Where? Say, not I'm Library? Finish. No, no. You could go to college. 
You, okay. could, you could get a professor. You could find any number of people that have the answers, could show you how to study them, could prove that. How do you know college is real, right? How do you know college is real? Why, how do you know math is real, right? How do you know anything's real? What, is, what does real mean? Lay it out. Could give you Am all I the real? instructions so you could go do it on your own without anybody else. I don't care about it that much. Then why, then why again, then Joe's, I, Joe's point, I why just, bring it I to just, us and question it? I just don't trust anything I can't verify for myself. But you, can. you don't have to get mad you because of that. Why you, are you mad because uh, of that? You're getting mad right now because I don't trust ver- shit from the government. You can you're verify angry government. At me? You can verify this. You just said you can't, but you can. <coughs> that's, that's the issue on some of these things with science. They are have veri- you verified it? Yes, they are verified. How did you verify it? I went to fucking physics class and what is at college. I got an A. Okay. So that proves that that yes. proves nuclear bombs. Well, he understands no. it. Okay. Eddie. He okay. can I didn't make it to, to that class. Works. I quit college. I didn't keep going down the nuclear class. That's farther in than physics 111 and 112 at Ohio State. They don't give it to the freshmen. Damn, I didn't even go it's high to Ohio level. State. <clears throat> That's it. And? I mean, if you want the answers, you can go get them. It's not just question the this world. This is why it's frustrating because you're you asking don't questions want the with no you answer. Just you're just causing that, chaos. Uh, in air quotes, government says exactly. Who so cares? Why do. are you so angry? I'm over not. That? It's frustrating. Why? Because the Why? world being flat, I'm not because nuclear bombs being fake, because dinosaurs not being real. What's, All those things the are crazy. Deal? They're a giant waste of time. For who? For us. When we're talking Let's about Let's talk about it. something else. Okay, but you like talking about those things. Hey, I didn't bring up nuclear bombs. You guys did. I didn't bring it up. But you really argued it for a, a while. I'm just bringing up questions and you're getting angry. I'm not angry, Eddie. Okay, good. Do you hear me being can, angry we, right now? You guys sounded angry. You said you were frustrated. What's frustrating? Frustration it usually is is in there with ang- anger. I'm just saying it, the 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 one fun point Eddie was making is like, man, I don't know nuclear science or anything like that. So how do we know those atom bombs are real compared to regular bomb? It was a fun conversation. That's it. Just to mix up uh, your fucking just creating tabs. chaos. Jamie. Chaos hey, for the purpose of chaos. Tomorrow morning. Turn in. It's just seven. a waste of time. Um, if you ask a question. You, right there. You sitting there. You. You ask a question. Ask a question. Probe the situation. And someone tries to give you the answer to your question. And your rebuttal for their answer is, how do you know that's real? You're an asshole. Period. I'm not going to hold you any longer. Like the video. Please hit like. If you don't like the video, I really would appreciate even a comment below and said this is why you're trash you little trash piece of trash crash go ahead and roast me in the comments just tell me why you're roasting me and i'll try to be better next time and if you're going to come back next time i'll post seven days a week so i'll be bro and i hope you have a good rest of your day Mwah. bro i don't know if anybody's told you like today but you're a butthole <laughs> besides Carl likes me